Hi, I'm going to be showing you how to waterproof an electronic door and window sensor for a Z-Wave smart home system to put outside. Uh, completely waterproof the electronics. Uh, this particular one is going on a gate outside. This company is called Ecolink for this particular switch. And I'll share with you why I use this particular switch. Uh, the switch comes with two different color housings, a brown and a white, so you can change those out for your color scheme. So uh, I ended up painting mine black for a gate that we have. Um, now once you get the product open, this switch has a very small board. The PC board on here is very small. A couple of things about this particular one is there is an external switch connection here where you can put an external switch and it'll still operate on your smart home system. It has a very large battery. This battery lasts, for me it's lasted four years and it's still not out on what I have installed. Okay, so once you take a look at the inside of this, there's a couple of plastic clips used to get the uh, PC board out. You just pull those apart slightly, the board pops right out. Very simple. The only other thing to worry about is the, uh, the battery clip itself take a screwdriver, put that under there, and it pops right out. So pretty basic in terms of getting the board out of the plastic housing. Now the product that we use to waterproof it is MG Chemicals. It's a silicon conformal coating, and the product linked is down below. Uh, as you can see, this one is already coated. I just got done coating it, and it has a nice, looks like a liquid sheen on top and uh, once it dries it is completely waterproof and protects the board and insulates the board from the elements outside so you can see it's still wet there uh, it's just been coated and it takes me it took me only a few minutes to coat it so just to summarize it's pretty basic uh, use this one product coating and that takes care of everything the product links to purchase these items are down below in the description block so please be sure to like and subscribe